Hi everybody, welcome to another episode of Adventures of Kramer. So today I'm up on the roof, trying to help see if I can't stabilize Starlink here, help make it to where I get a little bit less drop connection. So let's go ahead and check it out here. day whenever we were getting like those 50 60 mile an hour winds it was a lot more and that's what I was trying to show in the other video but the base seems it's really nice solid. and stable so we're gonna try seeing if we can brace up a piece of aluminum off the back side and kind of try and clamp it down and see if we can get this stable but also though this guy moves a fair amount I mean there's some of it is coming in below so that's the bottom stable this is still moving at least a half an inch yeah so you got two different pieces in there and I'm not sure but that's taking some pretty good physical pressure to to make that to move like right now it's, again, it's not moving once I stabilize the base yeah it's holding still so I really think the most the biggest problem is coming from the base okay and, and it's just because of the time with the amount of winds we get here it's worn the paint off inside here I suppose we can push the button. Yeah, the button goes in. Push that side. Push, push your side? <laughs> there you go. See how it's wore the paint off? And it's just kind of compressing in a little bit on the metal. So we're going to see if we can stabilize this back up a little bit. Because it's a good system. We just got to make sure for our wind. Other people may have the same problem in the, when you have steady wind. It's going to take its effect on things. Yep. We're just going to try stabilizing it up. Here we go. Okay, now that we got that strapped in, let's see how much it wiggles in. Does it do any back and forth me towards you? Just a little bit. Way, way less. Just this little bit in the satellite dish, and that's just suddenly the, the servos inside there. Simple little deal, but it should be able to, you know, if we stop losing the dropouts. Yeah. 
Nice and stable. Yeah, I wonder what they're going to be able to do though for people that have this in high wind areas. I know whenever they first released this ridgeline roof mount, it said not for high wind areas. But I thought it was because the base moving. This base doesn't move. No. It's the this part right here that was causing it to actually move. No. Now that's stable. I mean, it, it's set. Uh, again, we're, we're on a steady 10 mile an hour. It's not moving at all. It may get a little fluctuation with the uh, Big higher gusts. Gust, yeah. But I think we've taken... 60-70% of the wobble that was causing the big deflection because down lower it's the same here a half inch movement here by the time you're getting to the satellite you know it can be a mile or two off it, it's yeah it's, it's a big difference and it does make a difference so if you're having the same problem you know we'll uh, update and see how well it does through the night for keeping the connections because the winds are going to stay steady they're supposed to go 20 plus tonight uh, with some higher gusts, pretty heavy storm moving through the cascade, so we get it pretty good on this side of the mountain. All right. Okay, so back again. This is two days later now, and finally some wind picking back up. It's blowing a little bit there. Those trees really do help to block a fair amount of the wind. Isn't any movement so far. That's nice to see. Just so I can keep checking on it throughout the day and as we set and continue to get more wind. Okay, here we go. So it's been a couple more days. Wind hadn't really been blowing much. Now it's blowing a whole bunch. We're supposed to get 40 some mile an hour gusts today. So let's see how Dish is doing up there now with the extra support. Definitely some good gusts of wind that are blowing. Not seeing the wiggle like I had. Nice. I think it's working pretty good. Well, thanks everybody for watching. Thanks for hitting the like button for me. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe for me. Otherwise, peace everybody.